Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be telling you about this great for your Mac application called JDownloader. Now what JDownloader does is basically it downloads, as it says in the name, from uh, file hosting websites and it batch downloads, downloads. So it's really good for websites like Mediafire, RapidShare and so on. The only downside of the application is that it's Java based so it does take up quite a lot of RAM. Uh, so yeah so now going on to it you have downloads here and you can click down to show you all the links you've got currently you then have link grabber so if you copy a rapid share link or mega upload media any link basically it automatically puts in here and you can download it I think it might even work with YouTube as well which is great you then have add links and open containers you then have configuration so you can configure for like premium accounts for your websites if you have premium for them I have premium for mega uploads so I've got mine configured and then here are all the websites you can use so there's a long list you then have download network so you can tell it where to save your downloads to and then have reconnection this basically gives you a new IP I think which is really handy for downloading off RepidShare if you don't have premium because it just gets rid of your IP address and you can download the next file. You then have IJ Anti Capture which basically fills in the capture codes. You then have Add-on Manager so you can have so if it's in a raw file you can automatically unraw the file, shut down, automatically merge files and I'm not really sure on that one sorry. You then have Save Changes so you've got to restart. You then have add-ons down here, so these are just those again. You then have log, these are all of what you've downloaded and what's happened, did it work, etc. So here it is in the title bar, updates Verfügbar. That's German, but I'm, I'm rubbish with my German accent. And even same words. But anyway, here is about JDownloader, you can just see who it's made by you have in the top bar start your downloads stop your downloads pause your downloads you then have enable or disable monitoring the clipboard for new links enable or disable reconnection your reconnection is not configured correct and execute update and then also if you click here you can have add links clean up re uh, backup add-ons about j downloader and restart or exit so there you go guys, just a quick overview of the application JDownloader. My uh, rating of it would be 5 out of 5 because it's so great for the what it does. But the only downside for the overall, I'd give it a 9 out of 10 because it is Java so it does take up quite a lot of uh, memory. So just a quick uh, overview as I said. Hope you enjoyed it. Comment, rate, subscribe.